Hello everyone and welcome back to Darkwood. Now I feel like I've had some time <laughs> to decompress and to really kind of think through what happened last time and we're about to wake up in a new area for chapter one so I'm excited to dive in. Oh I did not miss <laughs> those background sneaking sounds. I love it. A pleasant warmth is emanating from the oven. I can sense a strange yet familiar scent. It's the smell of the protective substance, which gives me relative safety after dark. The vapours rising from the huge cauldron are distributed all over the house by a long pipes. As long as I remain inside my hideout, I have a chance of surviving the night. Hey, okay, protective substances. Oh, there's something pulsating there. <laughs> Maybe that's where the substance is coming from? When I arrived here a couple of days ago, the oven was basically prepared. I just needed to light it up to ensure my safety at night. This cottage must have been one of our hideouts. The inhabitants of these woods don't need to inhale this revolting gas. Okay, let's try and pack there. So it's been a couple of days since we um, were bonked on the head. And our hideout? Does that mean we have friends? Look at the weird bottle. The label on the bottle says... Staying out of the reach of the protective substance after nightfall results in immediate death in 99 out of 100 cases. It is advised to evenly spread the gas inside the sleeping area. Okay, so there's still a 1% chance. That's good, right? Warning. Even a properly prepared substance does not guarantee 100% safety. Remain vigilant. It is recommended to stay in well-lit indoor areas in order to minimize the risk. Okay, so this is a, a pretty good uh, solution to danger, but not perfect. A small empty cast iron pot. I haven't used it yet. I haven't felt any hunger or thirst since the accident a few days ago. I can't stop thinking about one thing. These mushrooms, these red pulsating mushrooms, they look so tasty. Maybe this pot will prove useful after all. Okay, yes, it does confirm that this is after the accident. Um, oh gosh, the fact we're not hungry or thirsty makes me think that we've now been infected by this plague. Not sure what the deal with the mushrooms are. Is that one making us like one with the trees or... I don't know, I guess we'll find out. Oh, cook. Oh, it's a syringe we picked up. Dose zero fifty. Oh, I guess we'll have to uh, dose ourselves up on whatever we cook. Oh dear. All right, let's have a a little examine. So we're definitely somewhere new. A photo of a road. The road home. It says Truga to and I can't make out that last word. And Rick. Okay, so let's replenish our supplies <laughs> and find out. Oh, hang on a second. There's a giant hole in the side of my house. Um, let's just uh, move that. Don't want a draft. Or any unwelcome visitors. Okay, 
safer already. Okay, let's have another little look around. Yesterday, I barricaded one of the windows. If I want to stay here for some time, I should do the same with the other windows. Okay, I heard a dog. Okay, so it seems like this is going to be our base of operation. So let's make it safe. Okay, workbench. Okay, I don't have anything so far. Okay, I've got plenty of nails, but need wood. Oh gosh. Oh, what is that? Are they rats? It sounds like it's moving. Oh, mushrooms. I mean, <laughs> I said I was craving mushrooms, so this is what you wanted, right? Odd looking mushrooms. Can I cook them up? Have a little snack? <laughs> oh gosh, that sound that they made though. <laughs> no power. Okay. I can extract 10 essence from this. Oh. Oh, okay. So I need to get four more. Oh, that does not <laughs> does not look or sound appealing. Oh. Bear trap. The bear trap under the window is still open. Looks like this night was exceptionally uneventful. Let's keep it that way. <laughs> I would much rather get some room, some alcohol so you can make a torch, bottle, and a mushroom book. The title reads, The Use of Mushrooms in the Household. Nice. Uh, can I read it? I'm not quite sure how to get to my special items. Oh gosh. <laughs> I'm going to forget whenever I push things. Makes a sound. Nothing under the bed. little house over there. Let's check out still inside and then we'll go to that. Yep, I checked it. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Do I hear fire? Oh, need four planks of wood. Okay, got a saw. Chop some things. Oh, a container. Ah, okay. Um, let's try four, eight, nine, two. Oh, <laughs> I suppose that would be too easy. If it was the same code. Oh, definitely had a dog. Maybe I'll be friendly. Oh, more squishy mushrooms. Hopefully they taste better than they sound. The generator is half empty. It contains enough gasoline for one more night. I should find a full can in the house, above the underground entrance. Oh. Turn on the generator before dark. Hiding in the shadows won't do you any good. They're coming either way. Oh, who's coming? Are you having a party, friends? Alright, another rag. Oh, a torch. Nice. And some matches. Oh, I don't want to burn up the torch just yet. Alright, and then let's have a look. What's this? Ah, nothing. Alright, so it mentioned something about an underground base. Okay, I'm here, and north is the underground entrance. So let's go north. Keeping an eye out, we don't really have a weapon at the moment. Hello? Is 
So I'm trying to figure out at the moment, if we had a special key, did we break in to this area? Oh, a tractor. Oh, nice, gasoline. That was exactly what I was looking for. But is this the entrance? No. Have a look around. So I wonder what that... Hmm. Definitely heard something bang then. What's this? Another broken tractor. Ooh. More gasoline. Some scrap. Oh, wire. I can use that to make a pick lock. Battery. Okay, we've got quite a lot of stuff. If I put my gasoline here, I have a little bit more space. What's that? Oh, I think that was just a tree. <laughs> that scared me so much. Oh, this looks like a... Um, like a, a vineyard. Oh, it's doing the thing where it, like, absorbs my light. <laughs> oh, crows. Uh, that normally means it's a bad omen, right? Like something dangerous is about to happen. So, our hideout, does that mean I came as a group? Maybe I'm, maybe I'm looking for someone, and that's why I came in here? And what was the deal with that plastic chick that the guy had? Was that just a memento, or? Oh, okay, so we found the entrance. I don't, I'm trying to kind of see what I'm looking at. Oh, what are these? Oh, poisonous mushrooms. Okay, don't eat those then. I might have a hankering for mushrooms, but not the poison kind. Alright, where's this entrance? I said there was a building, right? Oh, I've kind of gone off track. Oh, hello? Hello. Please say no one's home. Oh, it's barricaded. <gasps> Looks like there's someone inside. Oh. And a bear trap. So they're just as resourceful as I am. Oh, wood. Ah, oh, nice boards. I needed those. There we go. How do I get in? Oh, it's too strong to dismantle. Probably have to beat it. Okay. Is this window? Ah! Okay, it's not barricaded, but I see... <laughs> I see you there, bear trap. <laughs> oh, more wood. More bolts. Oh. Okay, be careful. This is the house. I'll find the entrance to the underground here. I'm not sure I want to. Oh gosh, the fact it's giving me health items. <laughs> Anytime a game gives you health items, it, it means that you're about to get hurt. Badly. <laughs> okay. Oh, I hear squelching. Oh. I gotta pack my lunch, I guess. Gross. Ah, Candice oven. Nice. Ooh, I got some scrap metal. A battery. Oh, a bullet. Some bread. I'm not really hungry. Hmm. Kind of full. Uh, right. We might have to come back here. It seems like there's lots of interesting stuff. And more gasoline. A pack of cigarettes? Not for me, thanks. Maybe I can trade them. Let's see if we can break down that other... Oh, that other bear trap as well. 
get the scrap metal from it. Nice. Oh, scrap metal. Okay. And it makes that window now safe to climb through. Is there a door here? Looks like there's another room. I haven't found the entrance to the underground yet. Aha! There is also. Oh, I hear more scratching. Oh, gross. Got it. The entrance to the underground tunnels. Okay. I'm I'm not prepared <laughs> to go in there yet. Um I think we probably need a weapon. I see you there. Um I know we have a torch, but it's pretty broken. And I've not got any space in my pocket, so I think let's let's go back. Let's drop off our goodies. Take kind of stock of where oh, I see you boys and mushrooms. Um, take stock of where we are and what we have um, and start boarding up some of those windows as well because I don't know what time it is I don't know if it's approaching night um, and I think oh, broken tree oh does that mean that the plague is faltering if the tree has broken because it did say that it was the trees that were blocking us off from everything. Ah, I'm back again. Okay. So, uh, what do we have? We have... How many boards does it say? Two. Oh, so not, not many. Not even enough to... Do barricade. Antidote. Mm. I feel like our character probably needs to eat though. So we'll worry about the antidote. Oh, I'm really close. Just need one more. That means I've got to be careful that something might poison me or infect me. Okay, so we've got lots of scrap metal and not enough wire to make a pick lock yet. But I've not come across anything that we need to unlock. Some matches, bottle, some alcohol so I can make another torch, some nails and a rag. I want to keep the bandages on me. Let's store that there. And let's fill up our generator to the max. So it did say we only had one night left of juice. Okay, if I remember right. Uh, my gasoline's equipped. Hold right click and then left click. There you go. Okay. This might... Oh no, I was going to say it might fill the whole thing, but we might just get to about the third, the last bar. Almost. Okay, that's it. Alright. Um, I'll close that for now. Okay, what time is it? I just need three planks of wood. I have two. Hey, okay, I don't want to go too far. <laughs> Alright, so... I wonder how we got here. It's the last thing that happened to us in the prologue was we got attacked. Oh, I can't. Oh, whoa. That doesn't sound like happy box. So, um, leave those guys be for now. Maybe I can find some meat or something to, uh, <laughs> appease them. Um, oh, gosh. Big friends. More poisonous mushrooms. Okay. Um, and it seemed like we were, like, attacked or grabbed. Mm. 
need to find more wood or a weapon or something. Oh, a fallen tree. Its bark looks particularly chewed up. Is that because of the dogs? Oh, the the light is changing. It must be time has passed. Maybe it's sunset. Ooh. Oh gosh, I hear a dog. I must return to my hideout. Okay, that sounds that sounds fine to me. Let's do that. Ooh, I almost stepped on those poison. Um, where am I? Oops. Let's grab this. Oh, maybe I'm risking it actually. Maybe I should. Oh, maybe he died to my mushrooms. Okay, where am I? Oh, I'm slightly disorientated. Oh, there. <laughs> I was about to run right past my house. Okay, open the door, turn on the generator, oh, and then let's jump inside. Okay, this room feels like the safest because of the bear trap. Um, let's just check all our doors are closed. That door is closed. Let's close this one. Maybe let's try and save. Okay. Nothing that I can do. Close this. And then can I go to sleep? No? No sleep for us? Oh gosh. Okay. Feels like night time now. Oh gosh, it's really difficult. It's like this room is sucking out all the light. Here it's really bright and then over there. Okay. Now, now we wait I guess. Um, I do have a torch. I'm not sure if I can use that to attack though. Nope, it still looks like I've got my protective substances. Breathing it in. It's a nice tube if I stand closer to it. Does that help? <laughs> oh, there you go. I'm gonna see <laughs> the smoke coming out. That's a sleeping area. Can I sleep? No. Hmm. Okay. I think that was just my footstep. I am uh, fully prepared <laughs> to bolt out the window if I need to. That's my lesson. <gasps> oh. Is that... <gasps> is that a dog? Oh my gosh, it is. It's moving. Oh my gosh, it's the, it's the ghost of the dog I had to put down in the prologue. He didn't seem angry though. He seemed quite... Is it a dog? Is it just me or does it look like it's got like a red mist around it? It's gone. Oh, what's that noise? Something bigger sounds. <gasps> oh my gosh, what was that? Oh no. There's someone in the other room. Was that the mistake? <laughs> Closing the door.
Maybe they can see me through the window. Oh no. Oh, it's just a dog. I thought that was a person. It said to put the lights on. So I don't think my torch is gonna affect anyone. It's just the dog. It's just the dog. Dogs can't get through windows. It's going away. There's someone in my house. Maybe they came through the hole in the wall. Maybe they pushed the wardrobe. I didn't hear it. Just the dog. Maybe, can he see me? He's looking like right at me. Okay, he's gone. <laughs> Oh man, am I going to sleep now? <laughs> no? I'm just going to rub my hands. Oh god, no, 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 generator, don't go out. Should I check? <gasps> no, 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 I was going to check, but I heard a noise. I want to check, but it's just a dog. It's just a dog. Yes, it's just a dog. Hello? Is there anyone here? They ran off when I closed the door. Hello? Oh no, the music's getting louder. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. Red. Oh wait, it's getting red. Nice doggy. Oh. Oh, okay. Day two. <laughs> Oh my, I thought I was gonna get... Wait. Huh. What's... When I... Put my light the other way? Oh, it's like pulsating roots or something. And then I shine my light and it... It goes away. That wasn't there yesterday. Was it? Hey, let's make sure that dog is gone. And I think we need to, um, let's conserve our energy. Oh, how much did that use? About, almost a bar. About a bar, just over maybe. Okay. Oh, let's check. I don't think our trap was sprung. Nope, that's all good. And we checked. Got a torch. Oh. Talk. Are you breathing into my tubes? I'll, s I'll stand here and talk. Even from afar, I can smell your putrid stench. Be glad I don't have an appetite for carcasses. Meat. The figure hides its face under the hood. It smells of wet soil and fur. I know what you're after. I can help you reclaim what you've lost, if you help me attend to a certain matter. What do you say, comrade? As he leans towards me, I can hear him giggling under the hood. 